It's time for Kip K's World live stream unboxing and a classic video clip, super chat, and more on today's show. And now your host, Kip K. All right, welcome to Kip K's World, the live stream, and uh, this is the very first time I've done this since 2008 when I was on another website called Live Now, which is not live now. It's not even around anymore. So I figured YouTube started this a couple of years ago. I have not done a live stream. Everybody's joining in on the chat. Good to see everybody today. Uh, don't forget, you can chat with me live. Join in the chat. Okay, we're going to a lot of cool stuff we're going to do today. And since this is the very first episode, uh, I would appreciate your patience for any technical snafus that might be happening on your end. Everything seems to be working fine here, so you'll let me know. Hey, it was so nice to see everybody joining in on the chat. And you know, if you want to super chat me, there's something you can press super chat and then you can ask me anything, I guess. So I'd love to see that happen. So today we're going to do a live unboxing of a cool new gadget or what may be a cool gadget. I think it's kind of cool. And then I'm also going to dig deep into the Kip K archives and I'm going to pull out a never before seen on YouTube video and play it for you guys here for the very first time in the world. All right. Hey, so uh, good to see you, Callum. I appreciate that. I'm glad to be an inspiration to a lot of people, I suppose, in the past 13 years that I've been doing YouTube. Yeah, you know, the camera's shaky because I'm, I'm, I'm bumping, the, bumping my whole thing. So appreciate that, Chris. Appreciate that. Letting me know about that. I'll try to be more aware of the shakiness. It's bad enough that the world is shaky. We don't need to have Kip K's world shaky too, right? So, yeah, so we're going to do the unboxing. We're going to do a, uh, a classic video clip. And first of all, I wanted to thank everyone uh, for the kind words that you uh, gave me, the emails, the notes about uh, my buddy Grant Thompson and his passing. Still kind of freaks me out. Um, but you know what? He's still living on with his videos. And be sure to visit the King of Random channel and keep watching the stuff that's going on over there at uh, the King of Random. So uh, appreciate that very much. Oh, we did have a super chat. So thank you very much. Oh, yes. Thank you very much for the super chat. Hey, so um, what do you say we dig into an unboxing? Now, I've got these intros for the segments some are a little bit long or some are shorter but uh i put a little bit of effort into these so let's roll it all right so today we are going to look at our very first gadget in the live stream on kip k's world and this is the switch bot uh, it's a home, uh, gadget that what it does is it allows you to not have any experience at all with electronics and changing out electrical outlets. Let me kill this light and that might be a little bit better, less shadows going on there. So it's a switch bot. So check this thing out. It's kind of cool. It's, um, obviously it's, a it's a little... It's a little switchy guy, and it's got this little arm on it. And what the arm does is on a regular electrical outlet like this, you mount it on the outlet, and then the arm comes down and flips the switch on and off. I actually have uh, the SwitchBot app. So let's load that up. SwitchBot app and Let's see if we can get this thing to, yeah, there we go. So when you press, see if I can make you, uh, let you see this a little bit better. My camera's kind of backing out the light. When you press that, 
See the little arm moves up and down? So that enables you to flip a switch. If you attach it to a light switch, it'll flip the switch off, but you don't wanna just have the light switched off, right? So it comes with a small little, this little tab, which has a little small piece of fishing wire on it, and it hooks on to this little clip, and then you can hook it up on the bottom of the switch, and it will, it will uh, turn on and off the switch. So there's no need to really change your outlets. I know people get kind of freaked out, freaked out a little bit about uh, about having to dig in there and possibly shock yourself, <laughs> get electrocuted. So the SwitchBot kind of takes care of that. Now they're priced about the same as uh, as regular outlets. Like they're about twenty five bucks, I believe, for the SwitchBot. It's about uh, the price, same price for a smart outlet. Let's get rid of this guy. You get the general idea with that. And also what they have is they have a, um, they have this. It's a uh, thermometer and a hydrometer. You know the difference between a thermometer and a hydrometer. Thermometer is temperature. Hydrometer is barometric pressure. Or it, I, I think that's what it is, right? So you can actually... This links up with the SwitchBot app, and by doing that, you can put it in your bedroom or in your office, anywhere you want, and it'll tell you the temperature. You can hook it up through Google and through uh, Alexa, and you can say, hey, Google, what's the temperature in the bedroom? You know, So that's kind of cool, and it, you can also integrate it with IFTTT. You know what IFTTT is? It's uh, If This Then That. It's a third-party application that links a lot of smart home devices with um, Google and Alexa. So initially I thought, you know, this switch bot thing, they, there's so many smart devices, they show it turning on and off, coffee maker. Well, most coffee makers have timers already, but then I realized that this is the perfect smart home gadget for somebody who doesn't wanna dig deep into changing outlets. So they're pretty cool. Um, and it's also one other thing they have. Yeah, I appreciate all your comments, man. It's good to see everybody. Good to see you all. Um, so let's get back down here. And there's also the SwitchBot hub. So by hooking this up, it's shaped like a cloud. You know, kind of does a, a rainbow effect. But this controls, this will control all of the SwitchBot devices in the house. And uh, so it's, I think it's pretty cool stuff. SwitchBot, I think it's just, to be honest with you, I think it's just switchbot.com, I believe. SwitchBot, switchbot.com, but you can, you can Google SwitchBot and uh, check out the stuff they have. I, I tried it out and it actually works really well. So I can go in, I can go, uh, hey Google, turn on the nightstand light. And we just have a regular switch like this and it turns on the nightstand light. And I can hook it up to Google. When I say good night, Google, it turns all my lights off, closes my blinds, and turns the bedroom light on so you're not stumbling down into the hallway. So that's our live gadget unboxing. Kind of cool. Every week that I do a show, I'm going to do a gadget. So if you have a gadget idea, send me an email to videos at kipk. Dot com. I meant to build a lower third key with the email address. So send me a video. And, and everybody wants to moderate. And, you know, I'm going to need moderators because look at the comments going crazy. You, somebody's been following me since 1995, which is actually pretty amazing because there was barely the Internet then. So I'm not sure, Rob, I don't know where, when you were following me in 1995, but I appreciate you sticking around that long. I don't know, kind of curious as to what the heck you could have been following me doing. Um, so that's our unboxing. And now let's get into the classic Kip K clip. <laughs>
All right, here it is. <laughs> Had a lot of fun doing that. Had a fun making those ball bearing rockets. They were, uh, I had a great time. And that's never been seen before on YouTube. Can you imagine that? You guys are the first to see that little clip. And I got a bunch of these that, you know, back in 2007, 2008, the how to world was brand new. All the DIY videos, it was stuff that now you look at and you go, whoa, that's pretty archaic and pretty uh pretty ancient but back then it was you know i did a video how to turn on your computer which was actually a parody because of all the videos about windows 95 the bugs that you find in windows and that type of thing so that got me on this how to trend and on that other website that i was on meta cafe for those of you that go back that far uh all those videos screen capture videos how to videos and then obviously i brought all this stuff over to you YouTube, and I've been having a great time ever since. Hey, I appreciate everybody uh, commenting today. I really enjoy the interaction. I wish there was a way through OBS, which is the software that I'm using to stream through YouTube, that I could get multiple people on. That's what I did back when in the now live days. I could have a whole screen, like six different people on with their cams, and we could really interact well you know you know i appreciate that twisted gaming because we got a hurricane coming hurricane dorian is headed s towards florida somewhere and i'm on the east coast of florida so that's actually let me take that back i'm in the west coast of florida so by the time it crosses the state hopefully things will be okay we'll batten down the hatches if we have to but uh you know what Years ago, the Indians, whether you believe this or not, but this is the story, the Indians came to Pinellas County and they have burial grounds. There's burial mounds in Pinellas County. And according to legend, they buried crystals in these burial grounds. And the crystals are what have kept hurricanes away from Pinellas County for over 90 years. We have not had a direct hit in Pinellas County in over 90 years. So I think we're going to be okay. Uh, but still, it's fun to have the news on and watch and see where this thing is going to go. Hopefully nobody will be affected by it. It would just float out into the Atlantic, uh, which would be good. So listen, uh, let's chat for a few more minutes. Uh, got a few more minutes left on today's show. I appreciate every, everybody's comments, and uh, I, uh, yeah, I am streaming through OBS. OBS is the software I'm using to do this, the multi-camera thing, and uh, so it seems to work pretty well, although my PC is probably not up to complete par. There may have been some dropped frames during the videos. I've, I'm kind of working on making that as compact and as the best frames per second as we can get out of this thing without it stuttering along. I don't want to have to spend a lot of money doing this, uh, but I'm having a great time so far on episode one. And if you would like to be a moderator, okay, send me an email. Oh, I'm going to get like 9 million emails. Send me an email, videos at kipk.com and tell me why you should moderate and then I'll pick a couple of people and the next time I go live I'll uh, figure out how to do the moderation thing it's, it can't be that complicated um, and then next week I'm going to be talking about this gaming chair that I'm in which is really cool it's not really going to be a live unboxing, but I'm going to show you the unboxing of the chair. We'll talk about the chair a little bit, and uh, you'll get a kick out of it. I love this chair. It's a super comfortable chair. So, hey, I hope you've enjoyed episode one. Ah, hey, thank you very much. You got you got to get some of those crystals. Hey, whenever I get a whenever I get thank a. Thank you very much. 
Whenever I get a super chat, I got to hit my staples, my staples button. Thank you very much. I'm having fun with that. <laughs> So, uh, also suggestions, show ex show suggestions, uh, different uh, kinds of things we can do on the show and do live. I really enjoy doing the live thing, and I I've got a whole I've got a whole thing of of sound effects I was going to get into and that kind of stuff, but we'll ease into this. It's going to be a lot of fun. Next time, another unboxing, another classic clip, and I may even get into doing a little live mini hack. We'll have to see how that all turns out. So thank you for everything. Yeah, I actually do have a Discord server, Chris. I haven't, I'm not active at all with it, uh, but I do, I do have one. And, you know, I'm a one man operation here. So uh, it's just a matter of finding the time to fit everything in. So I appreciate everybody tonight. Have yourselves a great night and we will see you next time on Kip K's World.